boys and girls. In this section of the tutorial, I'm going to show you how to thread your loom to prepare for weaving. For this project, we will be using a cardboard loom that you can actually make yourself. I've prepared these for you already and they're located in the weaving station. Now, a loom is a frame for weaving. A loom can be any size you want, depending on your project. The Iroquois used a bow loom, which was made out of a stick and then it was bent and threaded. For a wampum belt project, the looms are about 13 inches long by 3 and a half inches wide. At each end of the loom, there are six notches, you can see, cut. With about half inch spaces. Our next step is to string the warp threads of the loom. The warp threads are the vertical threads that form the base of the weaving. To thread your loom, you are going to need a loom, thread, scissors, and scotch tape. Your first step is to take your thread and to insert it into the first cut notch on your loom. Then flip it over and use a piece of scotch tape to secure the thread. Now, you're going to wrap the thread around the loom, securing the thread into each notch as you work. Wrap it around, secure in the notch. Each time, make sure the thread goes in the notch. When you get to the end, use the scissors to cut the tail and secure the thread to the back of the loom using another piece of scotch tape. When you tape down, make sure you don't tape over the other threads, just the end. Lastly, and most importantly, write your name and class code on the back of your project. Great. In this video, you learned how to thread your loom to prepare for weaving. Remember, insert your thread into the first notch on your loom and secure with tape. Wrap the thread around the loom, securing it into each cut notch. Cut the end of the thread and tape it down to the back of the loom. Write your name and class code. Now you are ready to move on to your next video.